It is January and it's Perth County and this is what you can expect. Uh, I am happy to be in my warm little workshop doing what I love to do. I got this Epiphone Les Paul which is a Chinese Les Paul and Tom shipped this one up from Georgia to get me to have a look at it and sort of bring it up to snuff. So here's Tom's Chinese Les Paul. So just to make my point, I'm doing what the entire industry does, which is play the open string and the 12th fret. Okay, and then now I'm playing the 7th fret. Hmm. And it's octave 19th. Okay, 12th fret again. Open. And the 1st fret. So I'm purposely tuning this to the open string and 12th fret, because that's what everybody does, right? Open string, 12th fret, fairly close. Okay, 7th fret, and it's octave, 12th fret, open string, and fretted 1st fret note. Perfect. Okay. Seventh fret. That's pretty good too. Here's our octave. Twelfth fret again. Open. And first fret. Okay, these are 9 to 46 strings, a hybrid, and they seem to be the best overall choice for this scale length because it's slightly longer than a regular Les Paul scale length. There's our third. Twelfth and seventh. And octave. Open. And first. Actually, you can hear that. That's kind of zinging. It needs a new nut anyway whether it's compensated or not. Seventh fret. Good. Nineteenth. Twelfth. And first fret. First string. Twelfth. Seventh. And nineteenth. And first fret note. Now I have to point out something else about this guitar that is very weird. This neck is so flexible. I'll just lift it up here by the tip of the neck. There's the A string. Actually right down to a G. There's the D string. This is why this workstation is designed the way it's designed, because it supports the full length of the neck, the neck-to-body junction, and the entire length of the body simultaneously. I know a lot of people argue, you got to tune the guitar in playing position. Well, when you got a neck this flexible, By the way, this has locking tuners as well. He wanted me to get a look at it and I did a light fret dress and kind of set it up as best I could. Now the compensated nut will definitely make a difference, but it'll never get rid of this. That isn't exactly what you would call well-aged wood. I mean, I think they shake the squirrels out of the tree, chop the tree down, and make a guitar before the tree hits the ground. 